So I took a short break, did some laundry, and uh, took Peanut outside. So I thought, well, before I give these books away, like I did the other ones, and I didn't get a chance to even read them to you, uh, we get these books at Goodwill. Then what we do is take them up to the candy kitchen in exchange for books. So um, this is a little golden book about Jingle Bells. And it's a new story by Kathy N. Daly based on the traditional Christmas carol. Pictures are J.P. Miller. Now, so a little bit of the song is going to be featured down there. It says, dashing through the snow comes the pop comes the bear family in a one horse open sleigh there's papa bear and mama bear and two baby bears see the bears okay hold on over the fields we go shouts papa bear cracking his whip and the sleigh guy glides down the snowy fields laughing all the way the baby bears singing christmas carols and nibble on cold plum pudding Turning the page, Herbert Horse loves to pull the sleigh. He flicks his bobtail merrily and the baby bears sing, bells on bobtail ring, making spirits bright and dashing along they go. Now they're in Rabbit Warren, a cozy little town and the rabbits and their friends come out to say, hello, come aboard, says Papa Bear, we're going for a ride and Cuddly Bunny and three bunny sisters hop onto the sleigh. Patrick Pig and his friend Katie Kitten hop in, then Dennis Dog and Stuart Seal and Richard Raccoon. What fun it is to ride and sing a slang song tonight, says Esmeralda Ostrich, and she too hops aboard and starts singing. She does not sing very well, but nobody minds because it's Christmas. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. That's their sleighing song as they sing. Over the fields they go, wrapped up in their furs. All of a sudden, stop, says a voice. Who can it be? It's a red man in a red suit and a white bear, beard and black hat, boots and a sack over his shoulder. It's Santa Claus. Help, says Santa Claus. I have no re six reindeer, open sleigh this year, and I'm too tired to walk anymore. What happened, says Papa Bear. My reindeers all caught cold and their mother has put them to bed with bed socks and tea, I hope, says Mama Bear. Yes, says Santa gloomily. Well, hop aboard, plenty of room, says Papa Bear, and Santa hops aboard, sack and all. Soon he's merrily singing their sleighing song. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. And so, for the first time, Santa makes all his visits in a one-horse open sleigh. He brings Tommy a toy train, and Dora gets a doll. Rupert gets a rocking horse and Bruce gets a boat. When Santa's sack is empty, Santa and his helpers climb into the sleigh and Papa Bear cracks his whip and off they go to take Santa home. And when they get to Santa's house, what a lovely surprise is waiting for them. Mrs. Santa has cooked Christmas dinner with lots of turkey and plum pudding and special fish for s servant seal and Katie kitten and crunky carrots for the rabbits and juicy corn for the Patrick.
After dinner, they gather around the biggest Christmas tree you ever saw. There are presents for all, and then there are balloons to blow and games to play. My, what a party! Before they leave, they pick up the six white rain six reindeer, all tucked up in bed and sniffling. Merry Christmas, they call, and the reindeers call, Merry Christmas. Then they all pile into the sled, Papa Bear, Mama Bear, and the two baby bears, Cuddly Bunny and his three bunny sisters, Patrick Pig, Katie Kitten, Dennis Dog, and Stuart the Seal, Richard the Raccoon, Esmeralda, Esmeralda the Ostrich. Papa Bear cracks his whip and send them off. They go in one horse open sleigh. And do you know what song they sing? It's on the next page. Jingle Bells. And that is your first little golden book that I plan on reading you tonight. So take a deep seat.